Taylor, is this me? Making her way to the ring from Orlando, Florida, Naomi. All right, just because Naomi dances, that is not an open invitation for you to do the same. Why? Because Naomi's actually good at it. I can do the electric slide. Naomi is one of the most respected superstars in all of the women's division. The two-time SmackDown Women's Champion and one of the best all-around athletes in the entire WWE Universe. But she continues to back everything she's done in the past up with substance here at WWE. Never shies away from competition, always seizing the opportunity to get better. That's what feeling the glow is all about. to start this match off with some show of sportsmanship. Oh, and I was right. What a cheap shot. Man, Zaguri gets her. Naomi is in the house. Well, you can't ask for much more than this, especially given how talented these women are. She goes for the cover. Digging deep for a kick out. She's still in this one. All the way up and around the world. The back of her head took most of the punishment from that. Naomi going to work now. Up and... Drop kick! Great athleticism.
We all know how devastating Naomi's rear view finishing move is, but to see how she's developed this submission maneuver in the excruciating pain her opponents endure, it's no wonder the hold is called a bad place. Naomi's got more moves than you can count, and I think she has a few she can use to finish off an opponent. The bad place submission shows how she's developed as a competitor and different ways she can hump. And Naomi forces her way out. Not even close. She's a lady that can turn it on quickly, no doubt about it. Look at this. Look at her go. Escapes trouble there. Liv Morgan just barely got out of the way. When she oh, gets man. in attack mode, look out. Naomi's going for it. Do you still feel the glow when the lights are out? She can end it here. Now, Naomi, this may very well be it. With authority. She's still in this one. Here we go. We knew this was coming. And the knee gets her good. We may very well be seeing the finisher here very shortly, guys. And when that happens, you can bet this one's going to be over. Well executed. And they Pops the shoulder up. She's still in this one. Working the midsection there. I'm with Corey. I suspect the finisher is on the horizon. And given how impactful that move has been as of late, I'd say there's almost no coming back from it. You're right, Michael. It seems like that finisher has become more and more impactful with each passing week. If that's even possible. She can't get away with this for much longer. And she goes down hard. That'll leave a mark. She goes for the cover. A oh, quick kick out from Liv Morgan. Wow. <laughs> oh, man. Wait a minute. She's a lady that can turn it on quickly, no doubt about it. Naomi is sizing up the situation. You still feel the glow when the lights are out? I bet you feel foolish riding her off now. Oh man, she's rolling now. Naomi is under mad assault. Watch this here. Watch out here. She's got her. What we've seen and heard tonight, there must be serious injuries. I don't know how much more damage one person could take. I don't care how tough you are. Look at this. She wants to have some words. And she doesn't look happy either. Lands a quick punch. Looking a little dazed here. Yeah, she's definitely not looking herself right now, Cole. Wow. Liv Morgan sizing it up. Wow, that's any indication she's not taking any prisoners in this one. That's it. That's what she needed. She goes for the cover. One, two, three. Yes! Unreal performance. These women put on quite a show. Here's another look. Hope everybody at home set those DVRs because that was a match you're going to want to watch again and again and again. Ever. I don't like to throw around a lot of praise.
but my eyes tell me that might have been one of the great matches in recent WWE history. Here is your winner, Liv Morgan. That'll do it, and it's Liv Morgan ending the night with a hand raise. Few things are more rewarding than that feeling of keeping your opponent's shoulders down for the three count. What's up, guys? Show tonight to G here, coming to you with another episode of WWE 2K19 Universe Mode Part 1 Women's Wrestling. Now, last week, Charlotte Flair qualified for the, the final four in the tournament to determine the new women's champion, and Kyrie Sane went to the semi finals of the Evolution tournament to determine the first ever women's evolution champion well tonight we had a showcase match between naomi and liv morgan who is of course new to his universe mode along with all of the riot squad sarah logan and ruby wyatt by her side and they helped her win this match against naomi pretty big win for liv morgan however we now focus our attention on the two tournaments for the two singles championships in women's wrestling. Wrestling, wow, wrestling. First off, it is another round one match. This time between Dana Brooke and Bianca Belair, and then in the main event we have another four, another four women vying their spots to be in the final four. We have Sasha Banks, Shayna Baszler, Brie Bella and ember moon that is for the main event but first we must go on to the second match in round one of the evolution tournament the statistician for titus worldwide and from cleveland ohio Dana. Tremendous athlete, great competitor. Dana Brooke certainly one of the hardest workers in the women's division. Always trying to learn new skills and techniques to better her game. Do you have any great stats on this match tonight at NXT for Dana Brooke? Yeah, 60% of the time, Dana Brooke's statistics are right every time. And what exactly are these statistics? Well, it depends on the situation, Byron. It's not like she just pulled these facts out of thin air. There's a lot of research, there's development, there's studies involved. Hopefully they come with a fact checker. Into the tie-up they go, but who's going to end up with the upper hand? Oh, 
she's starting to get on a roll. Dropped by a clothesline. Ladies and gentlemen, by now I'm sure you've heard Bianca Belair describe herself as the EST of NXT. Corey, what exactly does that mean? I'll break it down for you, Michael Cole. It simply means that Bianca Belair is the strongest, the fastest, the smartest, and the baddest around. The shoulder block. This one is over. Corey, thank you for breaking down exactly what it means when Bianca Belair says she is the ist of NXT. But don't you think Bianca has a bit of an overinflated ego for somebody relatively new to the scene? Absolutely not, Saxon. Just ask top NXT stars like Candice LeRae or Lacey Evans if it was Belair's ego that beat her. Those were cases of Belair proving she truly is the ist of NXT. games tonight. Everyone better watch out. Even me. Forearm right across the back of the neck. I've seen some unique offenses over the years, Byron, but perhaps the most unique thing I've ever seen is when Bianca whips her opponents with her own hair. I have never seen anything like it, Michael. But I'll tell you what, if I was to give advice to anyone facing Bianca, it would be to turn the tables against her. Go ahead and whip her with her own hair. To your point about Bianca's hair, Byron, I do think it's long enough that an opponent could likely use it as a weapon as well. Nope, that won't work. Grabbing an opponent's hair can lead to disqualification. Besides, everybody knows the best way to prevent Bianca from using her hair is to cut it off, a la Brutus the Barber Beefcake. Shoulders down, is it enough? And Bianca Belair with a quick kick out. Not yet. She is on fire. Message delivered. Oh, oh, she wants this win bad. We're witnessing a level of punishment that can only be described as severe. She goes for the cover. Plenty of fight left. She's still in this one. No luck against Bianca Belair there. She drops her with a clothesline. Dana Brooke looks like she's down and out. Not good, folks. This is not at all how she threw this thing up, guys. Give her credit, though, guys. She may be on the wrong end of this battle right now. Oh, Bianca Belair comes up big there. Wow, she's fought her way all the way back here. Bianca Belair, big move coming. Looking for an opening for that final driver. She's back in full control now. She's looking good now, guys. Take a look at this. She goes for the cover.
women of mixed martial arts, a protege of Ronda Rousey, Shayna Baszler thrives on the fear of others. Yeah, it would be a tough point to argue that Shayna Baszler may be the toughest woman to ever step foot in NXT. Uh, she's as tough as they come. Classic match with Ember Moon and NXT TakeOver New Orleans where she won the NXT Women's Championship. Champion. She's a trailblazer in the women's revolution. She got two hit television shows. Brie Bella, a billboard example of breaking the glass ceiling and pursuing all of your dreams. Brie Bella has inspired so many within the WWE universe with her work ethic, her dedication. Brie Bella has inspired me to never trust anybody. It's boss time! Here comes Sasha! And from Boston, Massachusetts, Sasha Banks! Myron, it's always a treat to see Sasha Banks on Raw! Sasha Banks has her own swag, she's got her own confidence, and she knows how to back it up. If there's a camera around, Sasha wants to be in front of it. If there's a spotlight out, she wants to be in the middle of it. Sasha Banks once stood in line for the opening of a refrigerator. You should get one of those uh, rings that say graves on it like Sasha has. I'll pass. Suplex. 
She goes for the cover. Shayna Baszler, no problem getting out. She's more durable than she looks, guys. From what we've seen in her tonight, there must be serious injuries. Hooked up and force on that slam. I gotta say, guys, I have been incredibly impressed by what we've seen from this superstar. She goes for the cover. Sasha Banks quickly getting the shoulder up. Looks like there's some more fight left in her. Oh, what a close line! She's starting to feel it. She's gonna need to find a way to mount an offense here. Back in from the floor. Inside the ring now. That kick had purpose. She's starting to sweat a bit. She's in there with some stiff competition tonight. Well, there's still plenty of match to go here, guys. Unless something crazy happens, I don't envision this being the end of the road for her. Well, Byron, you're not the only one impressed by what you've seen as of late. It seems these responsible for the weekly rankings have also taken notice because the superstar comes into tonight with quite an impressive spot. And well-deserved, too, I might say. It just goes to show that wins here in WWE go a long way in solidifying your spot on the roster. Going for something else here, Byron. But what? That's the big question. Guys, some are saying this superstar has begun showing a bit of arrogance since the latest weekly rankings were released. But the way I see it, that's just confidence. Now we have Ember Moon on the attack. She lands the belly to back. Oh, that hurt. Knee to the spine. There certainly is a fine line between arrogance and confidence, as Byron was saying, but whatever it is, I have no problem with it. This superstar has been on an absolute roll last night. Man, who really cares if somebody's being arrogant? As the old saying goes, if you got it, flaunt it. And this superstar certainly has. Three can't be stopped right now. Definitely not where you want to be right now. Gotta find a way to get out of this, Michael. Neither the nose. Here's her chance. Just go for the finisher already. I don't understand the delay. The object is to win the match, isn't it? Come on, let's go. Toss to the outside. Oh, Brie Bella able to avoid damage. Looks like she wants to beat her inside the ring. As Corey continues to criticize the big rock. This could be it, guys. But can Sasha Banks capitalize? Shayna Baszler, this might be it. She has got to take advantage here. All that's left now for Shayna Baszler is to finish this. And Shayna Baszler tries the early cover. And she kicks out at two. Not yet. She may be in a bad way here. We may very well be seeing the finisher here very shortly, guys. And when that happens, you can bet this one's going to be over. Oh, straight form. Oh, the reversal by Bree Bella. Oh, right to the spine with the knee. That was vicious. Look at her go. Broken up. And the match continues. A nice shot by Shanna Baszler. Look out. There she goes. Here's the cover. She delivers the axe handle. And Sasha Banks pops the shoulder up. This is amazing. So sure the body's supposed to absorb that type of impact. Bree Bella looking to end this. Ember Moon is getting wow, fantastic ability from Ember Moon. Warm up the bus. This one is over. There it is. Now the question is: can Ember Moon finish? She's in a bad way here, Byron. Don't count her out yet, Michael. Brie Bella just brought the WWE Universe to its feet. Game, set, match. This one is over.
The boss is giving some serious or Look at this. Oh, a perfectly executed dive. She can pick up the win here, guys. Oh, she's in a bad way now. Ember Moon is getting ready. What a move. You have to possess a different type of focus to punish an opponent like this. Bad news for the boss. Look at the look in her eyes. She's in the zone now. And there's the reversal from Sasha Banks. What a fantastic ability from Ember Moon. Now it's time to capitalize. Nicely timed shot by Brie Bella. Oh, no. She is on thought in count. This is a level of destruction no one was expecting. Man, she knows how to make a comeback. She's got her now. That's it. That's what she needed. No, she breaks it. Wow, she's quite the escape artist, Michael. Shoot slam. Sasha Banks on the attack. This is where Sasha Banks is at her best. The boss is giving some serious orders right now. That right there is why they call it. And the cover for the win! This is it! This is not going to end well for Sasha Banks. The boss trying to pull it out. Boss time's over. Look at him go. Now we have Ember Moon on the attack. This could be huge. She releases the hold. Looks like a questionable decision on paper. Shayna Baszler, this might be it. Now, she just needs to finish her off. Shayna Baszler making her moves. Shayna Baszler, this might be it. That should do it. Now with complete control. Look out here. She's in full control now. Oh, man, she's rolling now. What a grunt. That's how you put an exclamation. There's a pin now. Two. Three. The pinball and the victory. That match might go down as one of the best matches in WWE history. You can watch highlights of that one all night long. One of the great WWE matches I've ever been able to watch. I don't like to throw around a lot of praise, but my eyes tell me that might have been one of the great matches in recent WWE history. I can watch highlights of that one all night long. One of the great WWE matches I've ever been able to watch. This entire match was just one big highlight reel, and I didn't expect anything else. Here is your winner, Sasha Banks. You heard the ring announcer. This one's over, and here's your winner. To be able to fend off three other women like Episode that. Episode two cool. of women's wrestling is in the books, and would you look at that? Sasha Banks with the second fatal four way, which means we now have Sasha Banks and Charlotte in our final four. <laughs> we potentially have a four horsewomen final four for the women's championship. Mad, absolutely mad. Also, early on in the night, Bianca Belair qualified for the semi finals of the evolution tournament by relatively dispatching away Dana Book with quite some ease that is it for episode two of women's wrestling make sure to tune in next time for the third fatal four-way match and also the third match in round one of the evolution tournament I've been shows 92g and thanks for watching